Hello everyone welcome to part 3. Today we will make lips. Select the lips two middle edges then zoom in and by pressing G move edges inside mouth. This will be opening of our mouth. I am sure you have completed part 1 and 2. If not, complete with me because theory is nothing without practical. Okay I am sure you have done this much. Okay now select the whole loop of lips outer border. After selecting press Ctrl B on your keyboard. Two edges will form. Then select inner loop of edge and slide them by pressing 2 time G on keyboard. Now press Alt S and bulge out little bit. Now we will start to give volume to lips. After doing this select loop tool and make loop and slide it to border of the lips. After select the selection tool and press Alt S and bulge out the border of the lips little bit. After doing this go on left up corner and select face mode then select the inner faces of mouth and the press Alt S and bulge out in negative direction. Now go in edge mode and select the inner loop of inner mouth. Then press mouse right click and select the smooth vertices. Then look around the loop. If some vertices is in different position make sure to change it position in perfect order. After doing this select the inner loop and press Ctrl B and make two edges. After select the top edge loop from two edge loop we just created and press two times G and slide the edges little bit then press Alt S and bulge out little bit. Okay guys our blocking stage is completed now we add magic portion called subdivision modifier. Keep it both values of modifier only one. Okay everybody now fun part begins. Now we will shape the lips. You can make lips of your girlfriend. I don't have so I took reference images from internet. Shape lips very gently, don't just randomly give the shape. Properly with keeping quad in shape. Now I will do just tweaking and make shape and proportion as I wish. Watch carefully what I am doing. Try yourself to understand the mind of mine. This will also improve your learning skills. Try to understand the mind of the tutor. Okay if any new will come I will explain.
Okay everyone make neck thin a little bit if you are making female. If you making male then keep little bit thicker. Don't forget to zoom out and check the proportion of your 3D model. Okay everybody our part 3 has completed I am sure you have done this much. In next part we will do eyes and ears which is most complex part of human face but don't worry I have made method simple. For now bye.